the Lord of the Throne. No doubt, verily, to Allah belongs whosoever is in the heavens and whosoever is in the earth. And those who worship and invoke others besides Allah, in fact they follow not partners, they follow only a conjecture and they only invent lies. And who is more astray than he who invokes besides Allah those who will not respond to him until the day of resurrection, and they, of their invocation, are unaware. Say, call upon those whom you assert besides Allah, they possess not even an atom's weight either in the heavens or on the earth, nor have they any share in either, nor there is for him any supporter from among them. These are nothing but names which ye have devised ye and your fathers. For which Allah has sent down no authority. They follow nothing but assumption and what their own souls desire. Even though there has already come to them guidance from their Lord. And when mankind are gathered together at the resurrection, they will be hostile to them and reject their worship. If there were in the heavens and the earth other gods besides Allah. There would have been confusion in both. But glory to Allah. The Lord of the Throne. High is He above what they attribute to Him. So do not invoke with Allah. Another deity. And, thus, be among the punished. But the God of you all. Is the one Allah. There is no God but He. All things he comprehends in his knowledge.